It's a crime that's hit close to home for people in the Bilbao Estates, north of Southwest 8th Street. And as news spread, all of the neighbors we spoke with were on edge. If he's getting so close to us already, that means that he's everywhere and he can't, you know, he could kill anyone. Four women and a male transvestite, Lazaro Comasana, have been strangled or asphyxiated since September 17th. They range from 23 to 44 years old and have been murdered within two miles of each other. Their bodies have been found on weekends or on holiday mornings. Among those killed, Elisa Daphne Martinez, Charity Faye Neva, Wanda Cook Crawford, and on December 17th, the body of Nicole Schneider was found. This sketch was released of a man who had choked and kidnapped a prostitute before the first murder. The woman survived and described her attacker to police. The search for the suspect has involved intensive surveillance and the use of police decoys aimed at catching a killer. We have contacted just about every prostitute in, uh, on the trail, have advised them of the dangers involved and what they're doing, uh, and yet we all continue to see them out there. So once again, a West Aid neighborhood has been cordoned off. I am very scared, very, very scared. I'm, wor I'm, I'm very worried, too, because I have two daughters, especially my, my big one, Ileana. She's 19 years old. And, and I'm, I don't know what to think about. Tonight, there is no...